Division 4 Championship Volleyball action between second seed Sonora and the top seed Escalon meeting the Riffin. I'm Mark Willis reporting. Early on, it was Escalon jumping out to an early lead. Amanda Murphy's shot is blocked, but not to worry. Carson Hood is just going to dump it over. 11-5 in the first set. It's now 18-8 when the Cougars Hood with the back row set to Murphy and her shot is through. Nicely done there. Then it's Bella Cormack whose shot gets dug up, but she tries it again. This time it falls. That would set up this set point opportunity and Murphy delivers on that. The ball bounces around a bit. Four touches was called and Escalon takes the first set. In the second set, Sonora jumps out to a 12-7 lead. Here Gracie Bearden sets up Alexis Herforth who bangs it off the defense. But the Cougars would catch up and take the lead when Amanda Murphy and Valera Gonzalez combine for the block at the net. 14-13 Escalon. Then Escalon would take the set as well. Riley Latig throws up the behind the back set to Gianni Bava and the Cougars were in cruise control. Third set, there's no quit in the Wildcats and Bearden sets up Hope Hulick who slams it off the defense. Nice play there. Then Escalon on the short set by Hood to Bella McCormick who just buries this one. More defense by the net for Escalon as Hood and McCormick get up and combine for the block as these Cougars are a solid all around group. On to match point and it was Emily Vickers getting the set from Latigue. Vickers puts it away and it was all over. Escalon is your division four section champions in three straight sets. Sonora's only two losses of the season fall to the hands of the Escalon Cougars. Vickers and Murphy combined for 18 kills and 19 digs. It's amazing. I mean, we've been working for this, and now we're gonna go. We're gonna go run for state. We're a good team. All of us, like, we don't have just key players. Like, every single one of us is good, and I think that's what helped us go this far. And we're gonna keep on going.